Thank you. Oh my gosh, what a thrill to have a live audience. This is so fun, awesome, I love it. Um, welcome to uh, Eastview, welcome to the Spring Band Concert. I know some of you might not know me. Um, it's been a weird year not knowing people. Um, my name is Ben Harloff. I'm uh, thrilled to be a part of the, the Eastview Band team. Um, and I'm honored to be in front of these amazing students every single day. It's been a weird year. We all know that. Um, I'm pretty sure maybe 15, 20 years from now, the, the students behind me are going to be sitting there and hanging out with their families saying, man, I wish I could uh, have a Zoom band rehearsal because those were just so awesome. They worked out so perfectly. You know, the Wi-Fi always worked and the sound always worked. No, these students have been through a lot from starting hybrid, going to distance, hybrid, four days a week, and um, I could not be more proud of them and what they've achieved this year. I, I tried to do the math out as I was driving here. The amount of um, rehearsal time that we've had this, uh, this year, I couldn't think of it. I needed a calculator, but it's like, I don't know, maybe in a regular year, maybe two months of, of a regular band rehearsal season. So not a lot of uh, time throughout this year. So I'm so proud of them. Tonight is about celebration. Tonight is about playing some great music together. Tonight is about uh, honoring our seniors. Wasn't that a pretty cool uh, slideshow as you guys were walking in? Um, I told the other concert this. Um, I didn't recognize some of the seniors um, when I was watching the, the video earlier today because um, the, those pictures, I saw noses and I saw lips and, uh, and teeth. I had no idea that they had those things. Um, so it's a really, really, really special uh, evening. The next piece uh, that we're about to play, um, he composed this when he was 28 years old. Beethoven, a beautiful, beautiful uh, lyrical ballad. Adagio Cantabile.
We should do this concert thing more often. Maybe next year we can have four concerts instead of, uh, instead of just one. Oh my gosh, you guys sound awesome. Bravo. Before our last piece, we would like to um, honor a few uh, groups of people. Um, the first group of people that we would like to uh, recognize are the students who earned a band letter. Being a different year, we had to tweak our, our lettering policy. Um, usually we have, you know, 8, 10, 12 pep bands. Usually we have a full March band season, so on, ensemble, do, 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 whatever we can uh, think of. Well, we didn't have that, but we did have um, a few incredible extracurricular activities that went very, very successful. So our lettering policy was if a student did anything extracurricular with the Eastview band, we're going to give them a letter because they for sure deserve it. We had a great marching band season, incredible performances. We had a great jazz season. Our musical was unbelievable. Our Bravo performance was unbelievable. That percussion ensemble concert was incredible. So if, uh, if your child, if any of these students were uh, participated in any of those activities, we are for sure going to give them a letter in band for this year. So if you earned a band letter, please stand and be recognized. Bravo. The next group of, uh, of students that um, I'd like to recognize, and a few of them are for sure absent this evening, they had other, other commitments, are the seniors. And the seniors had like what, two and three quarters of a, of a regular high school career before things, uh, things happened. Um, a lot of schools, a lot of teachers, uh, administrators, they, they talk about legacy, what will... Uh, this senior class, what will be their legacy? What will they leave when they, when they leave high school? What will we remember them by? Um, I didn't know these seniors were there when they were freshmen or sophomores or juniors, but I, d I did get to see how they handled this last year. And um, we've all, you know, thought about when you go through something really, really challenging, if you're able to get past it, you're going to be a stronger and better person. I want to remember this senior class as um, the class that had perseverance, in all these challenging times. And the class that when you have a tough situation, when you have some tough times, the only way to get past that is to do it together. We would not have been able to have a marching band season or a jazz season or a musical or a bravo or percussion or a curricular incredible concert band year ending with an amazing concert right, right now without our incredible senior class in all the bands. So I, th I think a lot of them are gone. Why is it just you? Okay, hey, we're going to do it. Let's, let's recognize an incredible trumpet player. Um, I had a great time with him. His favorite, I'm going to mention this, his favorite memory in, in high school is playing trumpet with Mr. P. That would have been mine too, for sure. Wyatt, stand and be recognized. Thank you, Wyatt. <laughs> Before we play our last piece, um, if you could, um, there's already another concert coming in, already students or uh, parents lining up to, to get in here. If you could meet your child sort of towards outside, so that's not too clogged out there, that would be uh, wonderful. Our last piece, Adrenaline Engines.